question is this, how do I make my LinkedIn company page searchable? I think the real question is, how do I make it discoverable? And I'm going to share those ideas in this video, but before I do, hit that subscribe and notify button because I create all of these videos for you. So first of all, LinkedIn company pages are searchable. They're uh, in LinkedIn. I can do a LinkedIn search. I can look for Burris Consulting. And there's my page. I can look for LinkedIn training. Go to companies. And I'm in here somewhere. Now I have to drill down into it. Locations. I do Greensboro. And there's one of my pages. Winston Salem. LinkedIn Sales Navigator. So LinkedIn pages are searchable. Now, the question is probably more along the lines of how do I get my page to show up? How do I get it discoverable? So I'm going to share with you some tips here that you may get value from in that context. But before I share these tips, I'm all about helping people and organizations master the use of LinkedIn as a business tool. If you have a team or if you're a part of a team where this training could be useful, please reach out to me. All right, tip number one, know who your target audience is. It's important that you know who your target audience is because you're building your LinkedIn page for that audience. So you need to know who you're speaking to. Second tip, make sure that throughout all of your content, that you're using the keywords and phrases that resonate with that target audience. You can see I use LinkedIn training and LinkedIn coaching and throughout all this content here where I get about 2,000 characters, I try to use the phrases LinkedIn and LinkedIn training everywhere I can so that I'm using words that resonate with them. Tip number three, maximize the use of all of the fields on your LinkedIn page. You get, I think you get 2,000 characters in here. You want to maximize the use of all these fields. And again, let me reiterate, you're speaking to your target audience and in that text and messaging, you want to make sure you're using the words that resonate with them, keywords. Don't distract your target audience with messaging or stories that will send them down an irrelevant rabbit hole. You want to keep them focused on who you are, what your company is all about, and what your company does to serve them. Here's a big one that I often get pushback on. There is no need for you to talk about your history. You don't need to tell the viewer all about the history of your company and how you've been around for decades and years and this is what happened back in 1910 and 1950 etc cetera, etc cetera. you can give them context that you've been in the a context that you've been in the industry for x number of years so they know that you are you they can validate you based on longevity but do not tell them all about your family history and all that information that most people put on their website about pages. And I wouldn't even put that on the about page. I might have a link on the about page that says corporate history. But do not put that in your about section on your LinkedIn company page section. Tell them who you are, what you do, how you focus on serving and catering to your clients, what you can do to create value for them. That's what goes in your about section. Now, as you're building out all the content on your company page, now what you want to also think about doing is giving your target audience content that they want, content that can help them, content that can motivate them and show them that you understand what they're all about and you understand how to help them and serve them and cater to their needs. Give, that's the word here, give your target audience content on a frequency that you can sustain. And if you can't sustain it, then don't do it. You've got to give them information in a manner and a frequency that you can sustain so they keep seeing content that, again, they want may be useful and interesting in them. By the way, the, use the 90-10 rule. 90% of the content needs to be about helping them and not about promoting your business. 
always think about first and foremost helping your target audience giving them content that can benefit them 90 percent of the time and if you do that appropriately enough and regularly and sustain sustain you sustain that flow then that tenth time you can talk about your products that tenth time you can invite them to have a conversation with you about your business give is the role here here's another one use the admin tools that are available to you so that you invite more people to follow your company page and you you may if you if you're if, if you're an admin of the company page and you're not customer facing maybe you need to invite some of the customer facing employees to be admins and then help them in a very specific time frame and period and help them invite their connections to be company page followers so you build your followers in a very deliberate way inviting the people who are highly relevant to your company page and here's my last tip as you share content on your company page you're also going to want to copy the links to that content and share that in other places share it on your Facebook page and your Twitter account share it on your blog Share it in, uh, in maybe even LinkedIn articles. Anywhere else you can share not only links to your content, but your company page URL as well. Because the more you get your company page URL out there, the more you get the content that you post out there in other places, that creates what's referred to as backlinks, and that will amplify the opportunity for your page to become discoverable. Your LinkedIn company page is an important part of your branding, an important part of your business being discovered. So make sure that your company page is built out right. Make sure all your employees are connected to the company page appropriately. Create content, share content, and share that company page content in other places, and that will amplify the opportunity, again, for your company page to be discoverable. I'm Teddy, your LinkedIn and Sales Navigator strategist, trainer, and coach. If I can help you in any other way, you know how to find me.